All right, I'm going to get back to work on my uh, clay. And uh, as before, I'm not going to show it all because I do have instructional DVDs on sculpting the uh, human head. And uh, I'll leave it up to you to decide whether you want to uh, purchase one of those uh, instructional DVDs, the instructions on how to purchase and a review of all nine of my instructional DVDs is in the video description below this video. All right, I'm going to get started and I'll come back when I get a little further along on this uh, face. Time to play with some clay. The eyes turned out pretty good, uh, and they're hard, which will make it easy for me to uh, work around them. I think I'm just this is the first time I've tried this, so I don't know. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and start adding muscles and skin and all that stuff, and we'll see where we get, and then I'll come back and show you what I'm at. All right, what I'm doing is I've lined up the eyes. I've got the center of the pupil. Uh, evenly spaced between the center of the uh, nose and uh, lined up and I looked uh, down to, from the top to see if the eyeballs are the same distance from uh, in depth and so all that's been worked out now I'm just uh, solidifying their position by putting clay around the eyeball so that it won't shift and uh, it locks it in. I had the uh, heater on in here and it's softened the uh, clay just a little bit on uh, the uh, monster clay and so I sort of defeated it <laughs> by having a heater on, but it was cold in here. I don't like freezing when I sculpt. By the way, if you have friends that uh, are sitting home bored, you might tell them about my videos and pass on uh, and share my videos. Maybe it'll inspire somebody not to be bored. <laughs> In fact, share my videos anyway. And if you like my videos, give me a thumbs up. I'd sure appreciate that. A lot of people watch these and never thumbs up. And I think YouTube judges videos by how many thumbs up they get and uh, I'd love to fill my thumbs up quota with all the viewers that watch my videos anyway no pressure I'm not sure I like the idea that he's looking straight forward, but that's the way he's going to be. All right, I got the uh, eyelid sketched in. doesn't look too bad with the eyes straight forward 
I'm trying to get a particular look in his eyes because it really is the center of his soul. Well, as sometimes happens, I got carried away with a face, and uh, I may have to redo this face. I'll do that maybe tomorrow. I'm going to take it off the uh, uh, frame here, and I want to see if I, I'm pretty sure it's too big for the body, and uh, so I'm going to take a look and see if it, too big, I mean too wide. Uh, yeah, I'm going to redo the face. But first, before I do that, I'm going to check and see if it fits on the uh, body. And if it doesn't, then I know exactly what i got to do next time. So, I'm going to... Flip this off. That's not too big for the body, but I am going to redo that head. So I'll do that tomorrow. Sometimes it works, sometimes it don't, and this is one of those times when it don't. Well, as sometimes happens, you overthink something, and uh, that's what I was doing on that uh, head, and that's why it didn't turn out. Uh, see, even I make mistakes. <laughs> Believe me, I know my my abilities and my lack of abilities real quick. Anyway, I decided to go ahead and use the uh, foam head that goes with the uh, true form armature. And I'm just going to go ahead and slap on clay tonight and get... Uh, the thing at least started for tomorrow. Oh, and I found out that the uh, magic or the monster clay doesn't work out too well. And the only reason I say that is because it uh, has a tendency to uh, soften when it gets hot in the studio. And uh, I thought it might get cold and stay stiff, but it didn't. I, I have used Super Sculpty in the past to make an eyeball and put it in the oven and used it, and it worked out fine. 
but uh, anyway, I'll try not to overthink this second try like I did on the first. All right, good night, everybody, and I'll see you tomorrow. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right, see you next time.